Have you even deployed Wi-Fi 7 yet or are you still using Wi-Fi 6? Well, Wi-Fi 8 has already been demonstrated with first prototype connection. TP-Link says the test marks a critical milestone improving Wi-Fi 8's viability. This is from The Verge. They say while the test is light on details, TP-Link says it has validated the Wi-Fi 8 or 802.11bn beacon and data transfer capabilities, proving its viability for future consumer products. The prototype hardware was developed through a joint industry partnership, according to TP-Link, and the company expects consumer devices to be available ahead of the standard being ratified, which the IEEE expects to be finalized by 2028. Tom's Hardware says that TP-Link confirmed successful Wi-Fi 8 trials. On Tom's hardware, they also mention this and the fact that the next gen wireless standard ushers in advances in reliability and latency. So this is the announcement from TP-Link. TP-Link achieves breakthrough with first Wi-Fi 8 connection. This test marks a major milestone in ultra reliable connectivity for the next era of networking. Okay, so they don't really say too much, but interesting to see that TP-Link are already testing Wi-Fi 8. I have seen this in the past. TP-Link will release products before the standard has been ratified. So you need to be careful just rushing out and buying various Wi-Fi devices, even though they claim to be the latest like a Wi-Fi 8. But at home, perhaps you don't worry too much about that. You just want the best speed, the most reliability, etc. One of those benefits is seamless roaming. When you roam from one access point to another, it's supposed to work a lot better in Wi-Fi 8 than in previous Wi-Fi standards. Be interesting to see what happens in the future. But what do you think about this? Would you buy a TP-Link router? I mean, there's been a lot of talk from the US government and other places about not using TP-Link. But I know that they push the boundaries when it comes to implementation of Wi-Fi options. What do you think? Do you even care what Wi-Fi you're using at home? Perhaps you're still using Wi-Fi 5 or Wi-Fi 6. Are you even using Wi-Fi 7 these days? And you know, would you upgrade to Wi-Fi 8?